so welcome to the same frame. What's up, guys and gals? Welcome back to another episode of the Zane Frame. So while I'm trying to kill this motherfucker, Jack has a rant that he has, that he desperately needs to share with everybody. So uh, take it away, Jack. So at the at the end of episode three, um, I mentioned that there was something I wanted to rant about that uh, we didn't get a chance to get to. So now while uh, Zane is being die. amazing at being the blue bomber, oh, die, die, die. Um, I'll go ahead and explain that um, I work in a, an agency that deals with antibiotic resistant bacteria. Can you really not say the fucking like company oh. or what even the company like the institution name? I would prefer not to just because Oh like, shit, because we'd have to kill all of you. I just don't know how that works out <laughs> as far as the legality <laughs> granted, goes. Granted at this point in time I only have sixteen subscribers, so it wouldn't be too hard to locate and kill all you guys for government agents. <laughs> I mean you guys have seen Jay and Silent Bomb strike back. We can do that. Oh yeah I killed him. Alright by the way I didn't uh, even get to rant and Zane's already killed the thing. Dude it's there's great. plenty of fucking stage left. This was just to get I'm a joking. power I'm joking. No, joking. seriously, that wasn't even a real mid-boss. That was just to get this art container. What the All right, now we got it. Okay. Hey, fuck, Mega Man X is only fucking punches. I see that now. By the way, really quick, um, I would never harm you lovely 16 people who <laughs> subscribed to my channel. I love you all very much, and if you're uh, someone in the future and I've gotten more subscribers and watching this series, I love you equally as well. Just, I'm so happy you watched the show, and I hope you enjoy the shit that I put out. Legit. Uh, but no, there's actually like, a, there's a, we have to have a training to understand what we can and can't talk about. Like, it's, it's weird. So, anyway, I work on the agency. Round two! Motherfucker! <laughs> this one actually is a boss you have to fight. So. <laughs> oh shit, shit, shit. I work with uh, an agency that deals with um, antibiotic resistant bacteria. And so my rant is that the problem is, and there are understandable issues with this, where you go to the dock, it's like, I have, you know, problem. And the dock is, for multiple different reasons, inclined to just go, okay, here are some antibiotics, get out of my office. Obviously not that brusquely, but basically the problem is... Well, the doctor you would visit knows that the place you work is nearby. Well, no, it's not even me. Just in general. This is like speaking on a general population level. Because if you show up at a doctor and say, I have these symptoms, they're going to go, okay. Like, 90% of the time, it's Can a I virus. Say, I want this fucking eel's tail as like a fucking sculpture. I mean, look how beautiful that shit is. It's spiky. It's a nice shade of red. I like it. it. It's spiky. Yeah. So, if you yeah. show up... Nice. If you, if you show up at a uh, doc's office and say, I have these symptoms, chances are you have a virus. But they're going to give you antibiotics anyway because of, uh, I think, three different reasons. The first is, if it is a virus, the virus can yeah, still weaken your immune fish. system such that you can get a secondary infection from bacteria. So viruses do not respond to antibiotics. But if they give you the antibiotic and weaken the bacteria, so you don't get a secondary infection. The second problem is, thank you, Zane, is <laughs> if you show up and you actually do have that bacterial infection. Welcome to the learn frame. <laughs> they're gonna want to get. Oh you Jesus! It's missiles! Oh God! What? You have problems with lunch octopus? Yes, I do. I don't want no fucking takoyaki. I want some goddamn uh, just, um, God calamari. Damn. Uh, long story short, you don't always need antibiotics. And if you take antibiotics, it causes a problem because that's why we have MRSA. And here oh we are. Oh god, how many lives do I have? One, oh, two. sweet fuck. I have faith in your something. Well, spoiler alert, I don't have this fucker's weakness, so... Because apparently I am fantastic at picking all the things that are the worst. <laughs> you really do suck at this. Shut up. <laughs> Did you see his fucking tentacles? Like, he, like, pointed to me and he was like, you're going down. <laughs> you know where this is going? You don't want to know. Oh, God. You're going to find out, Not but only, you don't want to know. The thing. Not only uh, are you selecting, like, the hardest fucking bosses, but there's a pretty significant armor upgrade that's in a stage you haven't selected yet. Because I'm good at this. Yeah. <laughs> Well, I mean, I asked for a challenge, and <laughs> by God, are you giving me a challenge? By oh, virtue fuck. of being completely ignorant of uh, how this uh, game works. Oh, man. Oh, uh, oh, fuck. Oh, he sucked my life out. Oh, it's like a... Oh, are you serious? He's a vampire octopus? Yeah. But those are vampire squids. You're... What? There is no vampire Just octopus. Just pick another boss. The goddamn penguin. I don't even... No, All fuck right. it, mammoth. Mammoth? Yeah, why not? Okay. That, sh that fucker should be extinct anyway, kill him. Yeah, that's true. 
Maybe it's just a general pachyderm. No, mammoths are not general pachyderms. Here he comes, hippity hoppity. He's here and there. Is that what Finn said? Did you not watch Dumbo when you were a kid? I, I did, but it's been a while. Oh, look, it's a lava factory. Because you're Thank saying, God. like, hippity hoppity is everywhere. I'm like, that's, yeah. that's a rabbit. What do I do? What do I do? What an unusual view. I mean, oh, that's just making me think of, like, the Ephalumps from, uh, fucking Winnie the Pooh. Oh, yeah, they're Ephalumps and Woozles. Right, when, you know, he was basically drunk and or high, so... You're uh, drunk and or high. Uh, well, yeah, and? Do you smoke No, I don't. <laughs> okay. This actually was a point of contention. <laughs> this was actually a point of contention. I actually gotta forget, like, I have some friends who are stoners, and I'm like... Yeah. Wait a minute. <laughs> no, it's legit. Like, uh, well, no, it's I actually. I remember one of my favorite stories was like completely fucking with one of oh, our fuck. one okay. of our stoner friends. But um, was it uh, Jay, um, was it um, Daniel? Yeah, is Daniel? He also has a name that starts with a D. Uh, no. It was oh, not Daniel. oh, it was what? Jackson. Oh, yes, I know who you're talking about. Okay. All right, cool. God, keeping an honest on the internet's fucking chore, everybody. Especially when you're drunk. Like, this is a problem. Yeah. Um, anyway. We, we have, I, personally, I have trouble keeping track of names when I'm sober. <laughs> much less drunk and pl trying to play Mega Man and not die. Well, no, I mean, yes. I'm in the same boat. I'm not. I'm no, you're not. not. You're not even close. clothes. Well, no, I'm not. No, what I'm saying Look at this shit. I get crushed in a fucking second. I'm not playing you the game. You don't have to game. deal with these pressures. What I'm saying is I have problems with <laughs> oh, names, Jesus. too. Oh, you God. asshole. You're anyway, it, well, yeah, I didn't say I wasn't. Um, <laughs> oh, sweet Jesus, what even is this? God, what, what okay. was I talking yeah. about? Stoner friend. Heffalumps. Heffalumps uh, and muzzles. Yeah. Uh, and oh, then no, our, our okay, stoner no, no, friend, no, it was, um, uh, Jackson. Well, the thing is, uh, I used to play Mech Warrior Online Jimmy. for the longest time, and um, it's my like default mode of playing that game was varying degrees of drunk. And so, like, I it's I developed a repertoire with That's the... how I played Fire Emblem. It, yeah. <laughs> I, I was, it's, it, whenever I play Fire Emblem, it's just like the adventures of Zane, the drunken medieval tactician. I, well, yeah. I actually kick a strange oh. amount of ass, because I, I don't give a fuck to the right amount. Oh, yeah. Because with Fire Emblem, yeah, yeah. everybody dies if they die the first time, so yep. I'm super cautious with everybody. But when I'm drunk, I'm aware of that fact. But I'm slightly more, like, devil may care. Yeah. So it usually works out for me. No, right on. It's, uh, I'm in the same boat, because um, Mech Warrior Online is based on Battletech, for those of you who are not aware, and if either... Good exam. Well, for those of you who are not aware of either Mech Warrior God damn or it! Battletech, god damn. Uh, basically, my favorite mech was a light mech, which is anywhere to, like... Like a speedy one? It what it is speedy, but it's also anywhere between like twenty five to seventy five percent lighter than anything it would see on the battlefield. So it's it's not quite green land. It's not quite green arrow. I you lost me. Oh speed speed. Oh, God damn it! Remember I told you I I'm, a don't I'm a Marvel watch... fanboy, but I used to be a DC fanboy. I don't watch speedy, TV. Speedy is the fucking like teenage sidekick to Green Arrow. Okay. Cool. Yes. So you're like, I was speedy, I was like, well, then he's not quite Green Arrow, is he? Because he's the fucking sidekick. God, I hate these fuckers. They're in, like, every fucking stage, and it's just fucking bullshit. I would anyway. like to point out you just flawlessly killed that one. Anyway. I know, well, just because it's bullshit doesn't mean I can't flawlessly kill it. I just mean it pisses me off all the time. Legit. So, the reason why I bring a Mech Warrior online, I like to play uh, light mechs. I like to get drunk while I'm playing light mechs, which anyone who is listening, who is aware of what that means, is aware of the fact that that is a really bad combination. But, I a know, lot of people right. that I play with either like to play drunk or high. Wait, hold on a second. Alright. Oh, I thought it was good. Damn it. He does like a little... Woo! Thing. Oh, like a little oh bit okay. Yeah, yeah. I want everybody to hear that. All right, so uh, I'll finish up my story before you get in there, so we can hear it. Oh, okay. So basically, long story short, um, the people that I play with were like, "Oh yeah, you you, you totally smoke, right?" I'm like, "No, I just get drunk and play this game, and that's why I actually do as well as I do because um, I you know charge things that are three to four times my weight class and win because I'm drunk as fuck, and therefore I, my inhibition cortex is." Now I'm drunk as fuck, about to pass out. Destination inhibited. <laughs> Anyone else listen to Hollywood Undead when they were a stupid teenager? I have no idea what you're singing. But... Hollywood, we're never going down. 
I just there, you have a it's a are right, you know how Slipknot is like a group that has like a bunch of masks and shit. Yeah. Uh, there was a rap group called uh, Hollywood Undead, uh -huh. who uh, I was introduced by my same friend who introduced me to the vastly greater band uh, Mindless Self Indulgence. Uh -huh. But the first band he introduced <laughs> me was. I can't wait for you to shut me up and make me feel like badass. That's uh, 1984, isn't it? Uh, oh, the 1984. No, the second one didn't show me. No, that was, right. um, yeah. Just shut, that was shut me up off of, um, if I recall correctly, that's off of, uh, Frankenstein Girls Would Be Oddly Attractive or whatever that album yeah, is. Yeah, sure. The, the thing I actually remember the most about them recently is the Left Rights. Okay. Which was, uh, I think it's a lead singer from, uh, from My Own Self Indulgence and somebody, Urine or something like that, Jimmy Urine. I can't recall, but it's just fuck. It's just um, there's all kinds of fucking funny songs on it. It's like Alabaster Street. It's like oh, it's like roll up, roll up, roll up. Look what's coming your way. It's a big hairy toe heading right for your anus. Oh Jesus! All the people that you meet live on Alabaster Street. They wipe you with their feet. And it's just the entire album is basically like one long track, and it's like a variety show of fucking weird ass songs. And of course, a couple of a couple of them are done in like the, the classic, you know, ba, 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 da, ba, ba, of um, fucking mindless self indulgence. Yeah, yeah. I I just I still like them. They're like one of the very few bands I liked in high school that I still you know like. I mean, one of my favorites. They age well. They age very well. Yeah, no, absolutely. One of my favorite songs that I just completely forget exists is Shut Me Up. I can't wait for you to shut, shut me up, up and, feel, and make me feel like badass. <laughs> it's, uh, the music video was actually directed by Jordan Cox! By who? Oh, Yon and Vasquez? The... Yeah. The... Where the fuck is the back team? <laughs> yes, thank you. John <laughs> and the Maniac. Zim, Invader Zim. Yeah, fucking Nickelodeon. What was this? Just How like, the fuck did that get past I anything? Mean, the guy, the oh guy who God. fucking wrote Johnny the Homicidal Maniac, which deals in fucking, like, Satan's not that bad, and hell is actually people, and murder without consequence, and all that fucking shit. Well, no, hell is Earth just, you know, there are no good people. Exactly. Which is literally hell! He was like, no, we just brought all these people down to hell, and then they just kind of started their own, like, system of, like, currency and stuff. We didn't put that, that in That was place. my favorite part! It was like, wait, yeah. they make you need money in hell? And the shopkeeper he's talking to is going, what do you mean you need money in hell? No, you always need money. But people, yeah, people insisted they always need money. Right, it's like, you, you're, you're telling God, me that you have it. the ability to not need money, but just because you are so oh, sold on the fuck. on the concept of value, you automatically need money. And apparently, I am just giving Zane like a fucking aneurysm. You actually—that's my bad. That time, he did not give me that bad of a one. Um, he's one of the ones that's like not, oh my god, fucking hard. Like uh, Sting, Chameleon, or Launch Octopus, or one other. I'm not going to mention. Um, it's the goddamn pocket. He's bitch. one of the ones that was not that bad to face, but. I, I fucked up. Yeah, booze and just talking. All right. I mean, I was busy fucking singing left rights and mindless <laughs> self indulgence. Legit, so, legit. all right. I promise you guys. Next time we're gonna be on a stage. I can beat. I'm gonna initiate like veto powers. Cause here's the thing. I'm looking for a challenge. I'm already challenging myself in like two other fucking ways. So <laughs> I'm just if really... he select, if he it, literally, if he selects the one, like we've still got fucking Storm Eagle. Armor Armadillo, Chill Penguin, and Boomer Kowonger, or whatever his fucking name is. And um, that sounds Australian. one of those is still like one of the hardest ones. So if he selects that one, I'm going to veto him. And I am very confident I can beat <laughs> the other ones. So next time you'll actually see some progress. I hope you enjoyed this slightly extra long episode. Uh, I apologize. Apparently, I'm not the best Mega Man. Oh, goddamn. Well, but still, I'll sell. I'll sell for like top one thousand. When you're with playing that. with a handicap like me, I'm dealing with several handicaps. I have like an apparent supernatural ability to seek out the things that are going to fuck you. Which is worst. a gift, my friend. You shouldn't waste it. I don't. I, I mean, Be an advisor to an enemy country. I don't. I. We'll hey, talk coolest... about that at the next episode. Oh, all right, fine. I have words to say about I this. I guess I'm going to have to go back to my job as the head of the CIA. <laughs> and we'll talk about this at a later date. 
Whatever. <laughs> I'll see you guys next time on the Zane Frame. I'm Jack. Still. And I'm Zane. Yeah. <laughs>